we have come down to the final four. The AFC Championship will be represented by the Cincinnati Bengals and the Kansas City Chiefs. The Chiefs have won 12 of their last 13 games. The only loss, the Cincinnati Bengals by a field goal. The Bengals find themselves here after playing tough defense against the number one seed, Tennessee Titans. The Chiefs beat the Buffalo Bills in an overtime classic. Both of the teams have a lot of momentum going into this game. Anything could happen between these two teams. I really struggled between who was going to win, and I really wanted to look into the offensive and defensive stats for these teams for the 2021 season. So if we break that down even further, we got the Bengals offense ranking, ranking at 13th, while the Chiefs offense is third in the league. However, on defense, the Bengals, led by Trey Hendrickson, led, led by Sam Hubbard, led by Logan Wilson, a lot of these guys that have really stepped up in 2021, they're 18th ranked as opposed to the Kansas City Chiefs defense. Even though at times they can look good, when the competition gets tough, they do tend to give up a lot of yards and a lot of points. That's why they're ranked 27th for the league. So that's that's breaking down the stats. And now we ask you guys on social media, who do you guys feel like is going to win, as well as giving you our prediction. And here are the results. Very, very, very tight race between you guys and the viewers on social media. 51% liking the Bengals, 49% liking the Chiefs. I mean, we took a poll of probably 150, 200 people on social media, and it came down to legit probably like eight or nine votes between the two. Like, it, it was very, very close in determining who's going to win this game. Our heart is telling us to pick the Bengals. We want to see the Bengals succeed, and we do feel like since they beat the Chiefs earlier, we think that they can do it again. However, the Chiefs, a very tough team, do not count them out. I would not be surprised if the Chiefs were to win this game. That's why we have it very close. We have the Bengals winning by two. So for you guys that pick the spreads, Kansas City minus seven, that might be the smartest choice because it's going to be a very, very close game, I feel like. But moving on over to the NFC Championship between the San Francisco 49ers and the Los Angeles Rams. The 49ers have it up on the Rams. 2-0 this season against LA trying to make a 3-0 in a clean sweep as the motion by Debo Samuel earlier this season for the Rams they beat the Buccaneers they beat the Arizona Car Cardinals they beat the Cardinals in extreme fashion they dominated the Buccaneers from the majority of the game and mo most people are regarding the Rams as the most well-balanced team in the NFL thus far in the postseason for the 49ers, dark horse contenders, we've been talking about them being dark horse contenders all season long. And finally, they're getting a lot more credit. Let's just admit that the 49ers, instead of saying that they're the underdog, which they are, let's just go ahead and admit that they are a great team. Like beating the Packers, beating the Cowboys, beating the Rams in three straight games to get to this point. And we want to do the same where we break down the stats. So let's go ahead and break it down even further. For the 49ers, you may not believe it, but they have a top 10 offense. And the reason why you may not believe it is because a lot of people look at the quarterback and it's like, oh, well, Jimmy Garoppolo, he's not that good of a quarterback, so they can't have a top 10 offense. Well, when you have Debo Samuel that's uh, up there as far as scrimmage yards in the NFL, and when you have a great run game on top of that as well, you, you're going to have a 7th ranked offense. Uh, for the Rams, they're top 10 as well, uh, obviously. And on the defensive side of the ball, the 49ers have really stepped it up. They're a top three as opposed to the Rams. They give up a lot of big plays in the secondary, so they're only 17th in the NFL. Now, here's the thing. We took the poll on social media. This one was not as close as the other ones, but let's just go ahead and show you the results. Uh, we got the Rams here uh, winning 70% favoring the LA Rams, while only 30% is favoring the San Francisco 49ers. We're taking the Rams to win in this one as well. I know we picked against the 49ers all postseason long, so I'm not going to be surprised. Given that the 49ers beat the Rams two times this year, we won't be surprised if the 49ers win. However, to win three times in a row against a team that is better than you, that is very, very tough to do. The Rams, the spread, minus three and a half. That is what I am picking. So, seems like we agree between the Rams, between the Bengals. So if all of our predictions come correct, if the viewer predictions come correct, if our predictions come correct, then this is the Super Bowl matchup that you have to look forward to between the Rams and the Bengals for Super Bowl 56. What a matchup that would be. Honestly, any matchup, 49ers Chiefs, Rams Chiefs, Bengals 49ers, all of them, all of them could be good potential games. 
Leave your comments, leave your thoughts down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts and your opinions on who do you believe personally is going to make the Super Bowl and would you like to see the Rams or the Bengals? Battle it out. Matthew Stafford chasing his first championship. The Bengals, their first championship ever as well as a team. Leave your thoughts and your comments down below.